Hello everyone, and welcome to the second Don't Starve special. Now, like I said before, um, in order to make this ending, I want to make it climactic. However, I'm struggling to make it at all. <laughs> so, I'm going to show, so I said I'm going to cheat to take down the tree guard. And I, I you know, be happy that I was honest with you. Because... <laughs> Basically, the tree guard will not leave me alone, and the problem is he's right around my base, and I'm worried that he's going to wreck stuff in the base, because if he steps on it, it's just gone. Uh, so that's another huge worry of mine. So yeah, um, you're still going to have your conclusion with the um, with the one bishop, but this way, I'm going to be able to take down the tree guard, and so we won't have to worry about him. So let me show you how to do this. So... Um, one of the best ways to do it is to debug spawn things in, and you can only do this if you have console commands enabled. Mine was just automatically enabled, because I wouldn't know how to do that. I mean, I know now how, but I didn't at the time. And then, so, you can, so you're going to type in something like that, and make sure you're um, keeping watch where your mouse pointer is, because that's going to show where it spawns. Um, so debug spawn, and for this, all the debug spawns are available on the wiki, uh, for, but for this it's just fire staff. And then, like that, and it's right there. And you hit Control L, and then that should do it. And I looked up online, and tree guards are, you know, I already knew this, but they are a pain to take down. But um, it takes quite a lot of hits from a fire staff, and this does not seem to be doing anything. It's like, yeah, come at me. So we're gonna spawn in another, because I think I might have done it wrong. I think it means that it takes 25 rounds for it to burn, um, which is going to be boring to watch, but... Burn, tree guard! Oh gosh, it's setting everything else on fire. <laughs> Look at it. This is horrific. I mean, what would you do if you saw a flaming tree monster coming at you in real life? See, the problem is, is he's setting fires and then he's walking through the fires, uh, which is setting him on fire again. So this is one of the best ways to take down a tree guard, by the way. Um especially without putting yourself in immediate danger because you've got the range of uh, the fire staff. However, it's supposed to take 25, I think it was, hits from the fire staff. It's not dying. So maybe it's just 25 times for it, of it burning. So I guess we'll just have to be patient and slowly kill off the tree guard. I wish it would just die, like the game would just be like, yeah, this thing's dead. Because there's no way that it can kill us, but it's not gonna die. Because we've got the range on the fire staff, I can just continuously spawn in fire staffs. And he just can't catch up to me. You're screwed, buddy. Oh crap, we're going to attract the attention of the ghost if we go back over here. That's right. Take that. Yep, this is taking forever. Did he set himself on fire again? Because, okay, never mind. The fire is just taking a really long time to go out. Where are we on the map? Alright, let's start heading around so that we don't lead him to our base accidentally. This tree guard, he thinks he has a chance. But yeah, one of the most annoying things with tree guards is that you go through all this work of trying to kill them, and it really doesn't do anything. Or it really doesn't give you anything, I mean. It's... 
it, give, it, it gives you one less tree guard in the world, but other than that, it's still alive. <gasps> yeah, take that! And especially if you burn it down like that, because you get um, you get monster meat, which is pretty much useless. Um, but then usually you also get living logs, a bunch of living logs. And it's like, okay, I mean, that's sort of nice, but only so nice. Because there's, you know, living logs aren't that hard to come by. And they, you know, they're not that useful either. So, we lost a bunch of uh, health in that. So, well, not health, but hunger. Let's see, what are we looking for? Um... I think this is works. Nope. Um, well, that's raw. Not sure if I really want that. Maybe it's the other way around. Uh, gotta experiment with different lines of code here. <laughs> nope. Be right back. Okay, here, I've got one that sounds fun. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> and we'll eat these. Mmm, yummy fish tacos. Alright, everybody, so that has been taking down a tree guard. <laughs> so, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little special. Um, next time, we will get back into Normal Don't Starve with the, the series finale. So, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. Please leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.